Hello guys and welcome to the video. In today's video I will show you how to fix the skin tones in any video no matter how you color correct or how you color grade your footage. Without further ado, let's jump into Premiere so I can show you. Okay, so here we are in Premiere and we have our clip red. The first thing we need to do is to add Lumetri color. So go to effects and type Lumetri. Just drag and drop it onto your footage. Now you can see that Lumetri appears here in your effects and controls. It doesn't really matter if you're working on a raw footage or a color corrected or color graded footage. For the purpose of this video, I'm gonna go and add some kind of color grade. I'm going to choose this one, uh, just lower the intensity a little bit and that's it, it doesn't really matter. Uh, now, uh, if you want to fix the skin tones, we need to go to the HSL secondary panel. Just click on that and go down to its settings. To get the skin tones, we're going to use this set color picker. Just position it somewhere in your face, right click so you can pick up the color of the skin. To see what parts of your face are now isolated, you can check the box for show mask. And now you can see that some parts of your face are isolated. But now we need to extend the area of the face. To do that, you can use the add color picker, but what I like to do is play with the sliders because it's much easier for me. So let's do it. You can add a little bit of denoise and a little bit of blur. Don't mind that some areas of the background are also infected sometimes. That's because its color is similar to our skin tone. Now to fix the skin tones, we need to go back up to opacity mask. Be careful with this one, not lumetri mask, opacity mask. Just grab the pen tool, go somewhere on your face and draw a shape on your skin. So now here we have only this part isolated. To see the color of this part, we need to go to Lumetri Scopes and open this diagram here. This is the vector scope YUV. And you can see here that we have our color details. You need to remember that our color details always need to lay on this line here. So it doesn't matter on what skin tone you're working on in your footage, uh, the color details always need to line on that line. As you can see, our color details are a little bit towards the reds. To fix that, Go to effects and controls, go down to the color wheel and instead of one color wheel, activate all color wheels for midtones, shadows and highlights. Now for the midtones, pull them uh, towards the yellow because we have a little bit of red already. For the shadows, just pull them towards the reds so we have that blood flow in the skin. And for the highlight, just to balance the things off, pull them towards the blues. Now go back to Lumetri Scopes and now you can see that our line lies perfectly on this line here. Now go back to Effects and Controls, go up to Opacity Mask and delete the mask. Now go down back to HSO Secondary and just uncheck the box for Show Mask. And you can see that we have our skin tones fixed. So this is before skin tone fix and this is after skin tone fix. Before, after. You can also color grade your footage with just HSL color if you're in a rush or something, but we will leave that for another video. And that's it guys, that's how you fix skin tones in Adobe Premiere Pro. It looks complicated, but in reality it's much easier. If you have any questions, you can ask me down in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure to like it and don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you can see more videos like this one. Until then, peace.